Hi guys, what's up? I'm back with uh, The Expanse Season 2, Episode 7. We're nearing the end of the season, and I'm wondering how they're going to end it. I uh, still have a couple more to go, though. This is called The Seventh Man. So, are we introducing a new character? What's going on? Is Holy going to find out what Nomi did? I have a lot of questions. I also like the dynamic that's been going on between Amos and Alex. Uh, I wasn't expecting it and I like it a lot and I hope to see more of their friendship building. And some shit went down uh, for the Martian team that we were introduced to. And Bobby seems to be the only one that survived and she saw this thing that attacked them. I'm worried that this will seem as like an attack either from Mars or Earth on each other and that they're gonna start like a full-on war which is you know what she wanted but now that she's seen um, this alien thing face to face maybe she'll change her mind. I don't know. We shall see. I'm excited for this episode, so let's get started. How are you doing? Some pretty intense damage to the helmet. The seal match. Wow, that looks fucking wrecked. Looks like a snowflake, but it's red. Like ashes or something? So, that looks cool. It got nice fitted ships. But they'll never match our numbers. They're not idiots. They were the aggressors on Ganymede. How do you know that? that? Fear. We lost on Ganymede definitively. When losers seek peace, they look even weaker. Both sides lost. Y'all got Ganymede killed. On our terms. Mars will read it as a warning, which it is. Ganymede is the worst it's ever been between our nations. It's time to step back before we're all wandering through Listen the rubble, to her. defending ourselves with rocks and sticks. You'll never sell it to the Security Council. You will sell it, because you saved Earth from Eris. We all know who really did that. And whom do I say? <laughs> she when is speaking sense, though. Office. I like getting shit done, and I like to keep my head. She is my queen. My Your father was smart. Smarter. Yeah. She has a level head, you know, and she knows that it'd be this disaster for both Earth and Mars if they got into a war, you know. And there's something bigger going on here. Those put all of those bribes back into the neighborhood. Yeah, now it's practically running series. About time the belt was. See? You're already friends. He doesn't trust him. Nomi seems to really like she trust Fred, she trust or she she understands um Dawes. She almost seemed like a little bit in awe of him, and um, which isn't necessarily bad, but you know, he's a very interesting character, don't get me wrong, but I wouldn't fully hundred percent trust him. Because we know he's done like terrible things for what he sees as good, good reason, good cause, um, but it can be interpreted in a different way. Oh, triggered, triggered. Wow, the change in his face was immediate. All lost with your team under the mirror rays. Honey, you're the only one who survived. Our only eyes and ears on what. Tell them what you saw. Oh, she's going through a lot now. She's bleeding again. Oh, no. no. Nurse, we need a sedative. Yes, sir. It's intense. I want her to say what she saw. Like that unidentified thing in the sky and that alien looking beast thingy. Just someone that looked after me. Like you loved them. I think I did. I loved my mother too. Think. He's unsure about what he's feeling, if he's feeling shame. Shame. 
to feel how you felt before the world broke you, the safety of your mother's embrace. But you cauterized all that in order to survive. Yeah. You don't want that back again. The description of what happened, I think. Cauterize is like last embers and painful almost. We are about to rewrite the entire story of humanity. And if you like, you can be a part of that too. I don't like I can that he's you. interested in that. I know how. The OPA just saved Earth. And if that is not sufficient enough to earn their respect, we have their missiles. And that is our ticket to the table. But we must come together first. And I like how they all know that they're must missiles. send a representative. Martians, they see us as their possessions. <laughs> Animals to test their new weapons on. They're not wrong about that. Them. They will do not all of them. We must protect ourselves against these weapons. I feel like they should all be equal. We must the best solution. Unless you want to go into war too. That someday we will know the whole truth of arrows. They don't want another arrows any more than we do. If Johnson says that we are safe. <sighs> but I say, once a thing is written, it is forever. Losing control over the situation. I was on arrows. James Holden, huh? But not now. Oh, I don't trust Dawes. One by one, the best Earth has to offer us are coming to our fight. Detaining the missiles is an act of war, which will mm -hmm. lead to the end of the battle. Using get them gets us the same result. Person. That is why they are bombed, right? I guess, you know, as a sign of trust to give them back. The missiles are useless to us. That was okay, Mrs. Fred has plenty of supporters. But not ones who are mad at him. Do you know what everyone saw in there? Do you know what Anderson Dawes saw in there? You and Fred Johnson, two big noise earthers telling belters how they should run the belt. Can't run them. goddamn thing together and everyone keeps telling me to pick a side. That's less than a third of the full garrison. Why would Let's just... Focus on the facts. They weren't shooting at you though, you Seven gotta say that. They weren't shooting at you, they're shooting Seven behind them. Many. Fucking Earth has attacked us. It's not what you saw. They want a war. Damn it. We'll give them a goddamn war. What about the fucking thing you saw? That was not a UN. Was, it killed all of them. Ah, oh, I'm frustrated. Good and bad, don't get distracted by that. It will just confuse you. Good men do bad things, like Fred Johnson. And bad men do things believing it's for the good of all <laughs> mankind. I like That's this how I know description this isn't over, I can't rely on her. He looks unsure. We really lost Earth and all of this too, you know. And yet there she is. Hmm? Shining like a jewel. Enough. We're really busy. He's putting himself between uh, Dawes and Nomi because I feel like he knows that he he's trying to influence her somehow. I don't know. He's like no, looking I, straight at her. And she's looking all unsure and stuff. Do I, I believe you. We are in this together. Otherwise we're all We have to lost. be on the same page. Is she has the proto molecule still like. It's a big secret, girl. You know we can get you a new suit. Fuck off. Sorry, sir. No disrespect in <laughs> Sure. Captain Martin. Have you checked that drone's feed yet? We were on high alert for anything in that area. There was no drone over your position. No, 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 that's not right. I saw it. You think I'm making it up? No. no. I wish I you. Believe you. Help her remember the blue eyed thing. We've come a long way since our loading docks on cities. Hey, Marty. You don't get to call me that anymore. Pump, pump. I have history. Gummy, focus. 
The seventh man was bringing up the rear. The seventh man, he was chasing them. Yeah, chasing them. The Ewing Marines, they weren't firing at us. They, they were shooting finally. Them at him. Then what happened? The seventh man, he wasn't wearing a back suit. That's enough. She's had enough. <laughs> Oh, that was intense. That was intense. It's like holding my breath almost. <laughs> He's getting better. Keep my eye on you. Soon your legend will be better than mine. Gonna rope Must have been a great raid. Time it takes the earth to spin on its axis. The earth to go once around the sun. On Jupiter, you'll be celebrating your first birthday. It's a weird concept to It's hard about. to feel we matter out here, isn't it? They fired first. Maybe not at us, but they definitely fired first. Sergeant, this is bigger than you. you I know I'm not wrong about that. Well, truth is a tricky thing, especially when they stop down Stop trying to influence her. Just let her say hey. her truth. Everybody needs to know. You know what I remember most about her? So you didn't tell me a fucking story now to sell me on this bullshit. I love her. My apologies, sir. It's alright. I don't want her to answer to anybody. I want her to just go out on her own. Maybe she can join Holden's crew at some point. Mars. But I don't know where her story is going. It was interesting though. Do you understand? Yeah, but if she says there was something chasing both of them, kill both of them, then Earth and Mars has to unite to figure out what the hell they were fighting. When I get there, Sergeant, you're going to Earth. Oh, can she talk with Christian? Please. That'd be cool. I got a gun. Yo. The dogs do something. He has all the information. God damn it, Oz. He doesn't even know what's going on. I want. I'm it's frustrated. I don't know what Nomi is thinking right now. It's worrying. Shoot him down. Not down. Out. The Rossi is so cool. Ooh, nice. One. Two quarters are. Diogo? You got me. Just me. The decoy? Come around, you little shit. You got nothing. We lost doors. He's got quarters. Damn it, Diogo. They're gone. That's a smart move on Dawes' part. I just like, there's too many players in this game now, and like, I don't. Since we've seen most of only Holden's crew as well as Fred Johnson, you know, it's hard to know who to trust to with all this information, right? I trust Holden the mo most his crew because, you know, they were in the shit and, and they just kind of got thrown into this whole thing. They have no political agenda, anything like that. That's why I feel like Dawes is kind of a loose cannon, I would say. Um, but I do get why the OPA doesn't want to trust Fred Johnson. He's an earther. He did terrible things and nobody's ever going to forgive him. I mean, I feel like they all have to just unite against this proto molecule, Earth, Mars, and the belt. But each one of them are like, we need to be better, you know, we need to win this thing. And that mindset is just, it's not going to help at all against this alien. 
I'm glad that Bobby was able to remember that they weren't shooting at them. Uh, the UN was not shooting at them. They were shooting at something chasing them. And I feel like even though they're trying to silence her, she has to speak her truth at some point. So she's going to Earth for the first time. That's pretty exciting. I actually hope she gets to interact with Christian, although I don't know. Um, but I want her to speak the truth about what happened. Because then it will confirm for a couple people there's an alien out there. Or there's like aliens out there. And they'll. I just want level-headed people to, you know, unite, make a plan, figure out how to get this thing, you know. Because um, there's too many loose cannons and just shit could get even worse than what it, what it is. But, I mean, without Christian, they would have gone into an even bigger thing, you know. Earth would have attacked Mars more or on a different uh, playing field and it just would have kept going. So I'm glad they have Christian to, you know, calm things down. Um, I like that Bobby remembered that the UN didn't fire them first, but they fired something first. And Dawes has some vital information now. But we shall see what he does with it. If he can realize that it's bigger than him, it's bigger than his agenda. It has to do with not just the belt, but everything. Like, everything they know could be destroyed. Or changed, you know, because of this very molecule. And they do just you know, unite. Um, but I like the drama, I like the tension, uh, I'm a bit annoyed at Diogo, but I get why he, he, he's an op OPA, you know, he, I mean, his uncle died for the cause um, against Mars, and Dawes is just inspirational, even to know me, I, I got a weird vibe from her this entire episode, where she seems so unsure which side she's on, um, and she herself has her own information about this protein molecule. So when, when, I don't know when that comes out, but it's going to be pretty um, tense between her and Holden. Anyways, I hope you liked my reaction to this episode. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.